Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. We're back with another two good to go. We love them, don't we? Once again, I've made sure I've got something different for it. I'm quite excited to show you guys what I've managed to get. We've gone for two bags again, but different with this one. So the other ones I've always kind of eaten what I want throughout the day and then gone and got too good to go for like to have for dinner or something. Um, but today, I got some food last night and today. Um, and what I eat today is just gonna be what I get from too good to go. So I might go hungry, I might be all right. Who knows, stick around and you'll be able to see. But yeah, I thought I would try it a different way, um, spruce it up a little bit. So I hope you guys enjoy this one. Before we get going, please give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are new here. My target is a thousand subscribers. I'm so, so, so close, so close. So please just drop a subscribe if it's here or here, I can't remember. Please subscribe to my channel. I will love you forever and a day, I promise. Anyway. Let's get into it and see if I go hungry today or if I eat like a queen. Who knows? Good morning. Um, firstly, sorry to be starting this once again in my PJs, but basically when I'm doing like an all day video, basically I'm starving in the morning and if I got completely dressed and ready, then it would take me, well, it wouldn't take me forever, but I'd be even hungrier and hangry and I may as well just eat and I hope you don't mind. Anyway, so we're starting off with breakfast, hopefully. Let me give you a little rundown. Basically, I was meant to film this yesterday evening, but I ordered two good to go bags and one of them canceled on me last minute. So I then had to quickly edit another video. So I'm filming this on a Wednesday now. Last night I was meant to film this, um, edit it and get it ready for today. But another too good to go bag cancelled so i had to quickly edit another video that i already had thankfully one of the bags is still ready so we've picked that up anyway and then we're going to pick another one up this evening okay so we're working out so i haven't looked in this bag and you know me you know how difficult i find that so i've literally come home um and i it was cold and i picked it up so i've put it in the fridge hopefully it needs to be in the fridge i can see what's on the top so there we go this is the first bag, it is from Co-op, and look how big that is. Like, that is full. That is full. So, how much was this? This was 3 99 So I'm hoping I'm gonna be able to get something that I'm gonna be able to eat basically all day, breakfast and lunch, and then hopefully the one I pick up this evening, fingers crossed, I'm gonna be able to have something for dinner. Risking it a bit here, but what I can see on top, I know that I'm gonna get something. So, the first thing we've got, actually I'm not gonna show you everything because then I might just click off the video and be like, there you go, she's got everything. I'll show you some bits that I'm gonna be able to eat now, okay? So, the first thing we've got is some bread. We have got, it is hand-finished white sourdough bread. Is it Co-op's? Is that one of their finest? Irresistible. You can see there's a little mark there that says it was marked down to one, 166 it was two pound 15 so we will have some of that i doubt that there's going to be butter in here but i i'm going to use butter i won't put any other spreads on top okay what else can we have for breakfast i don't think we're going to get anything quite a good range in here guys although there's one thing that i'm not going to eat should i just show you that yeah sweet corn i'm not going to eat that i hate i don't like sweet corn and I've never tried it, tried it? I've never tried it um, like this, like on the cob. I can't bring myself to it, but I don't like sweet corn. I don't like the way it pops in your mouth. That would have been good, but I don't like them. Um, could I have a mid morning snack? Look at that. I've got a mango. I love mangoes. So it was 80p down to 57p. Looking in this, I think that's all I'm gonna be able to have for breakfast. But I think I've got some lunchy bits as well and some snacks looking pretty good so i'll have i'm gonna have that as like a mid-morning snack i think maybe before i go to the gym later have some of that um but yeah let's put some of this in yum look at that obviously i went for the biggest piece what else would i do that is good and look at the amount of butter i put on there by the way i've got eyelashes extensions i mean not just the fact oh i've got eyelashes um i haven't put them on this morning for you guys i'm afraid you know I'm going on holiday soon, so I've had to get eyelashes and then I'll do a top up before I go, so yeah. Sorry, it's not just for you. 
This is really nice. Yummy. I'm going to go upstairs, finish this off whilst doing some work. And then, a bit unlike me, but yeah, you're going to see me for a mid-morning snack before I go to the gym. Time for some lunch. I'm a bit... Don't know really what to have for lunch, to be honest. I've got too many choices. What I think I'm gonna do is play it safe because I don't know what I'm gonna be able to get from the place later on. And I don't wanna have something now that I could have for dinner and not have anything for dinner. So I'm playing it safe. So I am gonna have a sandwich. Obviously I'm gonna be using my sourdough bread. Oh, it's got sweet corn in. What tuna and sweet corn? One of those um, sandwich mixers. Yeah, tuna and sweet corn, which I don't like sweet corn, but it's okay. I can kind of pick bits out. I'll be fine. Um, and then I've got a bag of salad. So I'm going to put some of that in the sandwich and probably some on the side as well. So everything went out of date yesterday, but you know, it's not brown. It's not stale. So we're eating it. I've got some hummus. This is red pepper. What is it? Red pepper hummus. So I might put some of that on the side because I don't have crisps. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make myself a sandwich and then use some bread and dip it in some hummus. I didn't have any mango earlier before I went to the gym because I was a little bit busy. And then the time that I was going to have some, I didn't because I didn't want to get a stitch ready to run to the gym. So anyway, I'm going to cook, not cook. I'm going to make some of this and we can sit down and have a chat. Lunch is served. A lot of, uh, i got a lot of bread here, but... You know, I've gone half a sandwich of what looks like just lettuce. There is, there is tuna under there. Um, I haven't put any butter on. I don't know why, but I haven't. Um, and the hummus and some bread to dip in. I didn't pick out the bits of sweet corn. I just couldn't bother because I'm really hungry. I just chucked it all in to make it. It is quite nice, but I think I prefer like just making tuna at home. It tastes different than it would if I just made it. Don't know what makes it different, but yeah. I feel pretty lucky with what I've got already. I reckon I could have just done this video with just this bag, but my worry was that I wouldn't have enough and then it would just be rubbish. So you've got to order it like the night before if you're lucky. I think if you're lucky, you can do it on the day, but sometimes it does sell out like my one did yesterday. I see I was gutted because it was, did I tell you it was Greg's? Oh, it's a Greg's one, and I know I've done one Greg's one before, but I was so excited. But I was really hoping I'd have it because the one that we had last time was really nice. This bread would be nice with like, like to dip in some oils, olive oil and balsamic vinegar, things like that. Let's try it in some of the hummus. I've never had bread pepper hummus before. That's good. I think I prefer that over having a sandwich. I'm going to get on and finish my lunch because it's a sandwich and... It's getting everywhere. It's like, there's like flour around the edges and it's hard. So it's going everywhere for me. So I, how many times can I say so? So yeah, I'm going to finish it off. I will have some fruit, but I'll have that a little bit later. So yeah, I'll see you in a bit. I didn't really cut that mango very well, did I? But usually when I cut it in half, not in half, but like try and get where the stone thing is, I picked the wrong side to pull off, didn't I? Look how juicy that would be. Hang on, let me cut a bit more off. That's what I wanted. I think I got cut in my finger because something's really making it sting. What a waste this is, would have been if I hadn't collected it. I think mangoes are my favorite fruit. That bread, there's literally like two slices left. My boyfriend I made himself a bacon sandwich with it. I'm going to go to the shops and then I'm going to go pick up dinner. Fingers crossed, wish me luck that we're going to get something good for dinner. If not, it's fine because I still, like I said, I've still got something in that bag. Anyway, I'll see you in a bit. Good evening. So we're back from the shops. Don't know why I'm waving my hands around everywhere. Uh, we're back from the shops and we have got the goods. I don't know if they're goods. Mmm... I'll just show you. Although, actually, I'm not going to show you the bag and I'm not going to tell you where it's from. Basically, it's from a farm shop that is local to me, but I'm not going to tell you where, what it's called, because then you'll know exactly where I live. Not that I don't trust you, but there's some weird people out there. Um, so, basically, yeah, I've gone to a farm shop and I was hoping I was going to get, like, they do the nicest burgers, like the meats that they've got are just insane. But what was I thinking? Of course, they're lush, so why would they have any left over? Um, so, I've... 
Let me show you what I was thinking that I could have just in case this is going to be rubbish. Um, but I am going to eat the stuff from the farm shop. It's just, I would never have picked it. So in the co-op bag earlier was this, a, was it a pepperoni pizza? That was down to 67p. I'm not sure how much it was originally, but yeah. Nice little snack sized pizza. I'm going to leave it in the fridge this evening. In case I'm hungry, we might want to eat something later. Um, but if not, it's freezeable, so that can go in the freezer and I can have it another day, which is good. I don't even know what this is. I'm just going to guess. The first thing, obviously, this is amazing. Some sort of sausage roll. Should I take a bite whilst it's cold? Let's try it. I wish I didn't do that because that's not great cold. I'll heat that up in a second and show you it when it's looking nice. And secondly, I think these might be the same. It's a pie. A piece of a pie. I think it's chicken. I'm not actually sure, you know. Like, there's lots of veggies in there. I've got two big pieces. They're massive, that. But I'm going to heat these up. Obviously, I'm only going to have one. I'm going to heat them up. Shall I put a bit of lettuce with it? Yeah, I shall. Um... Yeah, let's heat this up and sit down and have it. Right, I don't know what's going on with my hair. I don't know, so don't ask, okay? Dinner served. It's a bit of a weird dinner. <laughs> so we've got this weird, what should we say it is? Pie? Quiche? No, it wouldn't. it's not nowhere near a quiche. It looks cheesy. It looks vegetable. I don't think there is chicken in there. Who knows? Um, and then I took another bite of that. Sausage roll. It's real nice. And then I got a bit of the salad as well. Let's have a bite of this pie thing it's cheesy there was a little bit of a cheese pull there it doesn't look nice to be fair though does it it's got mushrooms vegetables cheese let's try it oh wow that is insane that is the cheesiest i don't know what that is i reckon it might be like a vegetarian pie that is so cheesy this is a prime example where you can't judge something on the way it looks because if I went into the shop, there is no way I would choose that. But that is so nice. Honestly, I don't really know how to describe it. I'm not very good with that, am I? Um, I don't know how to describe it. Let me show you again. It's not going to look great. Sorry, guys. Yeah, it doesn't look nice. I don't think that's a way of me making it look nice. But it's just literally loads of vegetables. There's a bit of broccoli there. I think that's the stem of broccoli. I thought it was like a chunk of chicken. <laughs> and basically like a, like a cheese sauce mushrooms broccoli peppers onions and a ton of cheese that is insane right let's try the sausage roll hot that's lovely i'm glad that i picked this farm shop right i'm gonna finish eating this i've got a couple of bits that i can have to put in and i've got it next to me so i will literally see you in like three seconds <laughs> I literally look horrendous. I'm just looking at myself. I should have put foundation on. Sorry, guys. Um. Anyway, I have just finished my dinner. Obviously, you saw me two seconds ago, but I haven't finished it. I can't finish it because it's really filling. There's literally like that much left there. The only way that cheesy pie thing is lovely, but I think it's a little bit too cheesy when you get a bit further into it. The only way I can describe it is maybe like a cheesy vegetable omelette inside a pie. I'm too full for any more dinner, so let's have some pudding instead. There's always room for pudding, it's like a separate area, isn't it? I'm excited for these, and I think you're going to be as well. So everything now, obviously, is from the co-op. Look at these. I have never, I've never had one of these before. Never. But I'm excited to try it. Some Belgian bums. I've done well with this, haven't I? I might do co-op again. It's very sticky. Ugh. I don't like that. It's a bit hard. I think this is what it looks like just in case no one else, no one's had one of these before. And that's what it's like inside. It's like got raisins in it. I'll eat that cherry. I don't think I like that. It's a bit hard. The other one is as well. They only went out of date yesterday. Fear not. I will go and get the other dessert. And I know I'm going to like that one. Here we go. Here's the other dessert that was in there. What one is this? It's buttons. Chocolate buttons, cabbage yogurt. I haven't had one of these in a long time. I don't think I've had one of these since I had some in my 10,000 calorie challenge. Now, my boyfriend said to me today that but if I hit 1,000 subscribers um, to do like another 10,000 calorie challenge because that is my most viewed, I think it's like 23k. What do you guys think? Let me know if it's something you might like to see. I am going to bring this video to, to a close and stop blabbing. So, I hope you guys have enjoyed this one. 
please if you have smash a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you're new here or if you just aren't subscribed already i'm like a broken record i know but i need to hit my target of a thousand subscribers so please please just go and hit that subscribe button so yeah as i said i hope you guys did enjoy this one um a little bit different like i use the food to eat all day and i think it worked quite well i think if i obviously went to somewhere different like um like a starbucks or something i would i very much doubt i would be able to eat all day but co-op They've literally pulled out the bag. I reckon, I can't remember, well, how much, how much I paid. I think it was like three pounds something. And then you get like, I think it's either 10 or 12 pounds RRP. I reckon I've got more than that. What do you guys think? You guys are probably bored of me, so I'm going. As always, thank you so much for watching this video. I love you all so much. And I would love even more if you subscribe to my channel. Um, but that is all for now. So I will see you in my next video. And I promise. I, actually, no, I don't, I'll try and look a bit better than this. I'll try. I'll try my best.